I want to make a video of this uh, this flute the flute network DTX eighteen hundred just so you can see. I did find out I did charge the battery on this. You can see the battery over here. We switched the battery. We took the good battery. We did put it in this unit, the smart remote, and we found out that uh, it will power up with you know without being plugged in with the good battery but what we've determined is the battery in here now i switched it back uh and you have to have it plugged in now you can switch the batteries to be interchangeable we had this we had this bad battery plugged in here and we were running this we just felt like it'd be more um it seems like this would be more usable to be mobile on this one so for right now you're either going to need a battery or um and we looked up how much it costs for a battery and there's none really in the u.s it looks like you had to get a used one from china or a rebuild service which is, runs quite a bit of money um so you know hopefully you may already have one what we did we got an ethernet cable and we don't know how to really test this but i'm i just wanted to show you kind of and I'm not even sure that that's how you do it, but we, we hook these two units together just to try to, you know, kind of show you what is what you got here, you know what I mean? And I might not, uh, I went to coax and I pressed test. Oh, you're supposed to press enter. Okay, so I went to enter. And you can see what it's doing. It's giving me some information. Hello. I'm hoping that this right here might tell you something. Um, twisted pair network settings. Uh, you know, man, there's, there's just a lot of a lot of information in here that I don't know anything about. I mean, to be perfectly honest, I'm trying to exit back out of this now. Uh, auto test. Let's just switch this. Press test. And I'm sure this is going to fail. Okay. It's not compatible with the test limit. Continue. No. You can see the light works. Everything seems to be working with this. Oh, that one. Okay, there. Let me exit back out. Okay, I exited back out. And I guess that's just where, you know, single test. So, highlight the item and press test. It's not the same, same thing. So, I'm going to try to exit back out of that. Go here. Press test. Same thing. Nothing's compatible with the way we've got this hooked up. Um... Let's go to monitor, twisted pair, impulse noise, uh, you know, I pressed talk over here and then talk came up over here, um, test, it says it's testing, I think we did this. It's testing the impulse noise threshold. If you can see the green light flashing over here on this one. This is it's testing.
It still says it's testing and it's just flashing over here. Let's give this a minute and see. We might not get anything. I'm assuming, you know, this very well might not be the way to hook these up. I don't know if they're supposed to be, these are supposed to be hooked together. We just got this cable right here. Um, this cable right here was not with this, but I'm, I'll just leave it with the set. It's still saying testing. Just to show you, you know, it's a DTX 1800 cable analyzer, DTX 1800 smart remote. You got both of the chargers for the same AC adapter. This little piece in here, both of these, you know, both of these units here were, you know, included. This is a similar looking thing. Looks like it might have came from a job site or something. There was some connectors in this little Fluke Networks uh, bag right here. Some cable connectors. There's a cord right here that looks like it hooks up to something. That looks like it could hook into... It looks like it hooks into a computer. And then I don't know where that piece goes. I don't know if that hooks into this or not. Yeah, it could hook into the side over here probably. Um, here's some earbuds. There's another USB cable. There's some CDs or DVDs. This will show you, so this test thing, it just it must not be working. The test is not doing good. I'm going to stop that. Okay, that started testing by itself just when I hit enter instead of, so I'm sure that's going to do the same thing. That's on monitor. Setup. Like I was on right now, special functions. Uh, let's go to battery status. That'd be a good thing to check. 97%. See, I told you this, we, we, uh, Remote unit status unavailable. Memory status. Available memory 294. There's nothing. Looks like it's in there now. Tone generator. Remote connected at far end. There are no results in internal memory. View and delete results. We just now know there's no results. Set reference. Wow, that's pretty interesting that this shows uh, that these are connected. Incorrect adapters. Connect using one permanent link and one channel adapter. So... Version information. It's got a serial number, software 2.77, calibration in 2007. Okay, these are things that pizza potential buyer might need to know. It looked like I saw a date of 2019 on here yesterday. It looked like we're a pawn shop, so it looked like maybe that was where um, maybe the last time this was used. And I, I don't see that date on here now. I don't know if it got erased or what, but uh, insert a memory card containing software update. I would think you would probably have to use to cook this to a computer, maybe. I'm not even sure. I just we just I just wanted to show you what you know what we what we can see. This thing will light all the way up when you cut it on and off. See, see how that lights up. I can't get it to power off. 
I guess you just got to unplug it whenever it's plugged in hard. You just have to maybe unplug it to uh, get it to cut off. There we go. It cut off now. It made that noise when it cut off. Sorry for making the video so long, but I just wanted to try to give somebody a clue about, you know, what 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 I know, which is very little. I don't know little. I'm hoping that somebody that's looking at this, well, I know whoever's looking at this, they're going to know way more about it than I do. But I'm hoping by me scrolling through there, you can kind of see the condition of this. We know there's a bad battery. And it's, it's plugged into this side over here right now, okay? This battery here seems fine. 